Assalamu alaikum everybody. I hope you all are fine. So today is our science class and we will discuss some exercises on the page number 52. So in the exercise A we have 5 questions. So the first question is write down major parts of a flower. We had that four parts which are common in common flower. So the number one is sepals, number two is petals, number three is a stamen that is male part of a flower and pistil that is female part of a flower. So the next question is difference between self and cross pollination. So in self pollination the pollen of a flower fall onto the stigma of the same flower yani ki same flower ka jo pollen hota hai wo fall hota hai same flower pe jise hum kya kehte hain self pollination cross pollination mein kya hota hai in cross pollination the pollen of a flower falls on the stigma of another flower yani different flower different flower ka jo pollen hota hai wo fall hota hai different flower pe jise hum kya kehte hain cross pollination so the third question is what are the ways by which pollen is dispersed so the answer is Pollen gets attached to insects when they sit on flowers. When these insects visit any other flower, the attached pollen drops there. This is, this is how insects like bees and butterflies help in pollination. Kya hota hai ki jab ek insects kisi flower pe baitte hai, to kya hota hai ki unke upar wo pollens chipak jate hai. Uske baad jab wo orte huye dousre flower pe jaakar baitte hai, to wo pollens jo pehle flower ke the, wo dousre flower pe jaakar kya ho jate hai, attached ho jate hai. To is tarha se jo hai, wo pollination jo hai, wo done hoti hai by insects. Uh, insects mein kaun kaun se bees, butterflies etc. Theek hai? So the next is pollination by wind. Some flowers do not have nectar or a strong scent so they are unable to attract insects and such flowers pollination is done by wind. Kya hota hai ki kuch flowers ke paas zyada strong khushboo nahi hoti hai, nectar nahi hota hai jo ki sweet liquid hai to is wajah se jo uh, pollination hai wo kis tarah se done hoti hai, kis tarah se hoti hai, iska process kaise aage badhta hai through wind. Theek hai? So the next question is can pollination take place without pollen? Explain. So the answer is in many plants this is taken to an extreme where the flower doesn't even open and the pollen grows from the stamen directly to the stigma in the unopened flowers. This is called celestogamy. Kya hota hai ki kuch flowers kuch plants aise hote hai jinke flowers unopened hote hai yani jo khulte nahi hai. To uske andar kya hota hai pollen grows hote hai stamen se directly kaha stigma pe unopened flower mein this process ko hum kya kehte hai celestogamy kehte hai so yes pollination can take place without pollen theek hai to ye answer tha ki pollination pollen ke bina bhi pollination jo hai wo iska process aage bad sakta hai theek hai what is the difference between pollination and fertilization the transfer of pollen from the anther to the stigma of a flower is called pollination kya hota hai transference of pollen hoti hai anther se stigma pe flower ke jaise hum kya kehte hain pollination kehte hain the process of joining male and female reproductive cells is known as fertilization or fertilization mein kya hota hai ke male aur female reproductive cells aapas mein join hote hain to is process ko hum kya kehte hain fertilization kehte hain theek hai so in the exercise B, number one is tiny dust like particles that attached to insects when they visit flowers are called dash. Yani tiny dust like particles hote hain, theek hai, jo attach ho jate hain insects pe, ye tiny dust like particles kya hote hain, pollen hote hain, theek hai, jab wo visit karte hain flower pe. So the answer is pollen. Number two is the male part of a flower is called dash. हमने अभी पढ़ा था कि मेल पार्ट ऑफ अ फ्लावर को हम कहते हैं स्टेमन पर हमने ये भी पढ़ा था कि हमने स्टेमन को टू पार्ट्स में डिवाइड किया है दैट इज एंथर एंड फिलामेंट सो हमारे पास अभी कौन सा ऑप्शन गिवन है दैट इज एंथर जो क्या है मेल पार्ट ऑफ अ फ्लावर है द फीमेल रिप्रोडक्टिव ऑर्गन ऑफ अ प्लांट इज द डैश फीमेल पार्ट क्या है फीमेल रिप्रोडक्टिव ऑर्गन क्या है फीमेल रिप्रोडक्टिव ऑर्गन हमारे पास पिस्टल है जिसे हमने फोर पार्ट्स में डिवाइड किया है दैट इज स्टिग्मा Style, ovary, and ovules. So, the last blank is after fertilization, the ovary becomes a dash. Kya hota hai? Fertilization ke baad, jo ovary hai, 
वो किस में चेंज हो जाती है फ्रूट्स में ठीक है और जो ओव्यूल्स हैं उसके थ्रू क्या होता है कि ओव्यूल्स के थ्रू फ्रूट्स के अंदर क्या होता है सीड्स ग्रो करते हैं ठीक है सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर टूडेज लेक्चर थैंक यू सो मच फॉर लिसनिंग मी एवरीबडी स्टे एट होम एंड स्टे सेव अल्लाह हाफिज़